guys good morning welcome to another saturday adventure video i hope all of you guys are doing great this weekend uh, so today i don't really have a structured agenda but i figured i'd head over to eva beach area and check out white plains beach because i've never been there but i heard it's good for like beginner bodyboarding so i got my bodyboard got my super wide brimmed hat right here <laughs> it's brand new i actually bought it for an upcoming trip to um, the riviera maya but i wanted to kind of try it out so i'm currently here at olena by chef ron simon 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 and it's kind of hard to find however if you guys are looking for some really good um hawaiian asian fusion food near the airport and you are you land between like I don't know 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. like around lunchtime ish um, this is a really good place to go um, shout out to Felix and Amanda Eats um, they're my go-to food vloggers local you know here in Hawaii I always watch their YouTube videos so definitely recommend you check them out um, to get ideas on places to eat um, here in Oahu so yeah let's go ahead place the order I'm just gonna take it to go and then head to the beach I'm back in the car. I got my order. Oh my gosh, that was just the greatest ordering experience ever. <laughs> Rose, who is the wife of um, the chef, Chef Ron Simon, she is the sweetest thing. So thank you, Rose, for being um, so sweet and accommodating. She recommended a bunch of recommendations for me since I'm going to the beach. But let me show you guys what I got. So this is a calamansi, Filipino calamansi with some pineapple in there nice and healthy and then she mentioned that this uh, I forgot what she said this was but she gave this um, complimentary but basically once um, I drink a little bit of this to pour some of this in there and it creates like a purple color and I don't know I think this has some like health benefits and then I got some musubis which is really good this looks like uh, the brisket yum and then this looks like the Ooh, pork belly adobo, delicious. I also got uh, for my appetizer some fresh, super fresh ahi, seared ahi, delicious. And for dessert, look at this guys. This is like a s'mores marshmallow chocolate chip cookie, massive. It's, it's looking like it's melting already. <laughs> it looks so delicious. They just baked this fresh this morning. So highly re recommend checking them out guys. They are located near the airport on Nimitz Highway. All of this costs $27 so I think that's pretty good for my lunch. And these musubis are huge. Look. Look at the size of this musubi. It's like half of my face. <laughs> Awesome. I'm probably gonna start to eat the ahi since it's it's raw fish. I don't want it to get spoiled underneath the sun. So probably get started on that. Um, and then we'll head over to White Plains. I've never been there. It's over at Eva Beach. So we'll be exploring it together, guys. And yeah, hope you guys are having a good day, whatever day you're watching this video. <laughs> and um, yeah, comment down below if there's any particular places that you would like me to cover for you or any particular topics um, that you have any questions about. I'm more than happy to um, give some tips and recommendations or any questions that you might have about Oahu. All right, I'm gonna try the ahi. I figured I'd do a food review for you guys. Mm, trying to open it. Oh, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Let me show you guys this one second. You just gotta open the sauce and not make a mess. Oh, okay, too late, already made a mess. Sorry, bear with me. <laughs> you know, during this pandemic, I got so used to eating in the car, right? Since dine-in was kind of like closed down for a bit. Good thing she gave me a lot of napkins. Thanks, Rose, you knew I was gonna have to use a lot of napkins. All right, guys. So look at the sh the translucency of this fish. I think I'm gonna go ahead and dip that in there. Mmm. 
Oh, that is good. I believe this was like $8 for this. This is a good appetizer. I love raw fish. Love poke. This is seared perfectly, just right. Look at that, This, the edges. So good. Try to have a little bit of the cabbage. Mmm. Okay. Let's give it, I give this a thumbs up. All right. Sounds good. So the rest of this, I'm gonna eat this at the beach. So I'm gonna go finish this up and then we'll get back on the road. arrived it looks like there is plenty and plenty of parking here it's a pretty big parking lot so I'll go ahead and show you guys what the beach looks like here enough to swim though so I think I'll stay here get in the water they see all that This building behind me, that is the uh, restrooms. There's showers in there as well. Lockers, I think for day use. Um, you can also, if you're military, you could rent a surfboard, but military ID required. But other than that, if you're non-military, just enjoy the beach. There's designated areas here, like the left side is for swimming, the right side is for surfing. What do you guys think? Should I get in the water? <laughs> Gnarly. Yeah. Alright, yeah. I think I'm going to get in the water, but I'm not going to bring the GoPro because it's really rough out right now. 
So I'll see you guys after my swim. good place to um, like for example if you're not completely comfortable with waves this is a good place to go to to get comfortable with waves I'm okay with waves um, it's just you got to study the ocean first before you get in kind of <clears throat> know where the calm areas are know where the wave breaks but what I like about this beach is it's actually um, <clears throat> sandy bottom at least near where the shore is so and it's a gradual slope so there's no like sudden drop so that's pretty good so I'm just taking a break now to have my lunch so this is what the um, I think this is the brisket yeah this is what the brisket looks like it's actually super super tender guys so good dessert let's try out this marshmallow s'mores cookie looks delicious guys it's huge it's the size of my hand <laughs> mm. look at that yeah pretty good pretty good Aloha, I'm back in the car. Just got rinsed off, changed into some dry clothes. I would say I actually like this beach. It's my first time here at White Plains Beach and I like it because it has a pretty local feel. I mean, it's mainly locals and, you know, military people, but um, the amenities are really good. Um, there's like an indoor and outdoor shower, well, at least for the, the women's room. Um, a lot of space, like there's like a park area like a grassy area where you can set up tents and do a barbecue um, then of course there's the beach area like there's there's lots of space it's a pretty spacious beach so if you guys are looking for a place to practice surfing if you're a beginner this is one of the good places to go um, there weren't a lot of people out on the water but not nearly as many as you would find in Waikiki Waikiki is just so crazy crowded so uh, this place is really cool. I like it. Um, I try to do a little bodyboarding, <laughs> but I ended up just practicing my duck dives because um, the waves crash pretty crazy on the shore, um, near the shore. But yeah, I had a lot of fun. I'll definitely be back here. All right, guys, I just want to say thanks for following along my adventures today. Like to support the video, subscribe if you hadn't, and I will see you in the next video. Have a great weekend. Bye.